Milo! This is gonna be a long night. Kill him. <laughs> Bless you, like Jack. And it's just giving me such high anxiety. I can't lie, I'm somewhat nervous. All the few couples that we find in terms of your interests and your careers, your mm -hmm. goals, etc. Being an element of travel as well involved. Filming will be up to one month. Hey, so where are you off to? Okay, so oh, I don't know why it's been doing that. that yeah, reason. This is the, you know, this is the issue that I was saying about with the pro thingy, the other one, it doesn't do that. Oh, it doesn't do it. No. I'm joking, no, it doesn't do it. Hi, guys, we are on the way to get Milo. <laughs> she came up with a name, to be fair. It's a sick name, everyone's bought to it, like it just makes a lot of sense. Milo, so yeah, we're gonna go pick him up, but we just want to quickly stop off at Pets at Home and get some bits for Milo. I don't know why I'm more nervous. I feel like Milo's probably more nervous than I am. Because it's your dog, that's why you're more nervous. Yeah, I just want, I want him to settle. That's what I really want. Guys, she keeps saying it's our dog, but I'm telling her it's not our dog, it's her dog. And yet he's the one who really wanted us to go today. What? Yeah, when I showed you the video, you was like, should we go today? I was like, let's go then. Cat. I'm not driving all the way to wherever we're going. I'm just Why gonna not? Drive to I was enjoying home. being a, a passenger for once. No, it's kind of comfortable in this seat. No. Huh? No. This seat's not comfy for me. It's not really my aesthetic. It's not really my vibe. But this is your car. Why did you buy it? <laughs> if it's not comfy. I drive when I need to, or if I have to, not because I want to. <laughs> Anyway, guys, we're on the way to Pets at Home now. Um, I'm not gonna be holding the camera because I'm not good at keeping it stable, as you can see. <laughs> um, she's obviously gonna kick me out of the passenger seat, so the next time you see us in this car, I'll be the one driving. <laughs> he loves deal. driving. It's not a big deal. He does love driving. Um, do I love driving? Yeah, you're quite a good driver as well. You're a really don't good driver. Try and, don't try and butter me, me up. You see in this? <laughs> You're a good driver. Oh, and hey guys, oh, bye. Oh, you can, they've got little stuff that they can try. That's extra, extra small, which I think will be what we need for him. Okay. Should we get him some treats? <laughs> Should we give him turkey and hemp, babe? Carmen, Carmen food treats. Should we get balls? Yeah, go on then. Okay. That's you understand how big they are? Because these cage will take up that whole door bit. Yeah. That doorway. Yeah. So we should get a medium size so it doesn't feel too. Yeah, how? When you're he just keeps crying. Let me show you him. Hold on. Hold on two seconds. Can you stop him from crying? Milo, show Auntie Chrissy your face. He's looking at the ca he's looking at the camera. Oh. He's crying. Milo, look at Auntie Christy. Hi, honey bunny. Oh, he's about to cry. <laughs> Oh, he's gonna be so nervous just for the first couple of days. Hello, baby. So we have Milo. Say hi, Milo. He's not interested. Milo, you interested? I think he's still a bit sad, <laughs> if I'm being honest. He is everything I've dreamed of. So yeah, very excited. And he's in a good home, which I'm happy for. I'm together, guys, because I feel like I'm gonna have some hard days but we've got this. Don't we, Milo? Oh, he's gone to bed. I'm excited. When I get in, I'm gonna show my mum. She has no idea that I got um, Milo and she's going to scream. She probably won't come to my house anymore, but I feel like she'll fall in love with him and then be like, mm, okay. What do you think? Your mum is scared of dogs. She is scared of dogs. I think she's always gonna be like, get that dog away from me. Move it away from me, Milo. Oh, I read This is gonna be a long night. She said he might not eat. Mm. What's he looking for? Milo, what do you want? I won't tell you. Oh, do you want water? Where was my leftover? Let me go and find this one. Come on, you need a thing. Hello. Hello. You don't need to be scared, do you? Kimmy. 
I'm not coming to your house again. Mom, you don't even think it's fine. He's so cute. No, it's I, no, it's me and it's me and Marcus's dog. No, it's your dog. I beg. Mommy, it's her dog. Bro. It's not mine. Mommy's looking after him. Oh yeah, mommy, mommy's looking oh, after him. Which mommy? No, mommy, because obviously we was gonna give it to because <laughs> because. <laughs> Because only because um, Yossi and Shegs are obviously coming with us, so we're gonna ask if you can help. Yeah, because they Look said they you. would, but they can't. Forget. <laughs> <laughs> like, 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 You can say hi to all your aunties and uncles online. Are you going to say hello to them? Wherever I am, he is at this point. That's who we are. I might not be able to record. I do care about you. <laughs> I'm vlogging, you know. No, I haven't. I don't know who I am anymore. Last night she called me Milo in bed. Be for real, sir. I haven't reported back on our first day with our newborn, Milo. It has been very real, I will say that. Um, he didn't really sleep very well in the night. We put him in his kennel so that he, you know, he just doesn't like ruin the house or feel really scared because it was a new space and everything and just kind of like cage training him a bit. But he didn't love it and online I saw people saying oh like you know just try your hardest to ignore it because they will get used to it but hearing him cry was really hard um, we both got up really early today um, and now he's sleeping through the whole day <laughs> um, he's not even eating that much but they did say that that could happen because it's his first time like still adjusting to the move um so yeah so i'm going to a jimmy choo event um which is for the opening of the jimmy choo gallery i can imagine that being absolutely stunning so we're gonna go to that so i'm just quickly getting ready and then i will come back to you guys in a little bit once i'm ready i've got a really dark blemish that I know is from a recent spot which is really annoying me but hopefully we can get that to fade before May. My sister out. Literally. They forced me out. Didn't force you. Gave me two hours to get home. She wanted to come. Who does that? She wanted to be here. <laughs> but um, yeah so I'll show you guys when we get there. Um, and yeah catch up with you later. I don't know how on earth I got it wrong but I think I went to another event address that's for another day so <laughs> now we're basically in an Uber. <laughs> well I have to be grateful for that. Good morning guys. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Somebody wants to say good morning as well. Say good morning. Are you gonna sleep? Wow. Have you never left him at night before? I mean, has he never been left before? He told us that we need to leave him like for an hour, then two hours, and then increase it. Let's go. Hi guys! It's a beautiful Monday morning. Myla, say hello. Where are you? Say hi. Myla, you wanna say hi? Milo? Milo? You wanna say hi? Okay, he does. Say hi! Say hi! Just, he just, yeah. Anyways, we are going to the office. Um, today I set him up for his flea, I think, thingy. So, for now, he's not really allowed to play play outside. Um, I set up his flea 
worm and flea no he's had his worm he hasn't had his flea because he was too young so i'm currently setting that up for him oh how comfy do you look in your chair love it do you love it yeah i've literally been freaking out <laughs> so our parcel may have got stolen and if it has that stress is about to be dramatic for me i can't lie i've come to the office so that i can like pack orders and everything i've come early and um yeah we don't know what's happened no one seems to have seen anything like that which i feel is a good thing because what i'm hoping is the courier service maybe they noticed that they couldn't leave it there and then they've taken it with them and they're re-delivering today i have no clue but it is not where they said it would be and it's just giving me such high anxiety i just don't know i just don't know in other news as well i don't know if i've given you guys any type of like heads up but we're leaving and we've got to take all of this with us Service. How can I help? Hiya, um, I hope all is well. I just wanted to double check something. Um, so we have um, a Royal Mail business. So we have um, one of your gentlemen's or ladies come to collect our parcels. Yeah, you, you could certainly do that. I mean, if you give it a couple of days, yeah. um, I'll give you an email address. You can always fire an email into the team. Hey guys, I am off to an event. It's very early. The event is a, a morning event, but being a dog mum, I have to like pack Milo's bits. I need to get his treats as well. I'm dropping him off at Marcus's sister's house um, so that he can play with them, which I think will be super fun. Um, but um, yeah, we're in a rush, so let's go. But first, please. The beat is nice. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. I take my flowers. <laughs> we just made it into London. Um, we're a bit late for the event, actually. I think we'll be on time, you know. Like, you reckon? Time people come. That's also very true. Kind of. But um, it's raining. It's cold, guys. Like it's cold. It's freezing cold. It's like winter's back again. London is so <laughs> weird for that day because like it was getting warmer and now, now all of a sudden it's freezing again. You know, again. Saturday was so warm. It's like yeah. summer. It was so nice on Saturday. Yeah. Because we went on like I think we took him to like a park area to like mm. play and stuff, but. Mm it's now freezing like you'd never think that was it a sit like three days freezing. ago it is freezing cold <laughs> so. yes but we'll catch you guys later at the event i feel like i can hear people in here you look really nice as well i love this outfit you. Just, like, there was yes. how are you I'm good. You look lovely as always. Is it your birthday yet? Not yet. Not yet. Next time. Yes. Oh my gosh. I did tell Zoe. I was like, can you send them a picture saying I'm so happy. Thank you so much. Like I've got so much bits. Even for the boys as well. They're going to be so happy. Yeah. Yeah. Next month. And thank you for your lovely contact articles. Oh, do you like them? Yeah. Good. Royal Paris and the Right to Be NGO have created an educational program. Stand up against street harassment by Royal Paris. Thank you, Robert. Um, my name is Laura Whitmore, and um, I am honoured to be here today um, on behalf of this fantastic campaign. For them. And we went to a shop, and I was actually grabbed by a man. <laughs> I'm just so happy for her to be back yeah. on YouTube. Like, yeah. I'm, I'm happy. Guys, you have to check out Flo's content. If you're not already, what are you doing? Because her content is amazing. We love it. She's a lifestyle girl. She gives girly aesthetics always. <laughs> How did you guys find the event? It was so good. You love it? You all yeah. need to know about the five Ds. Yeah, Very I'll probably explain it more when I get home as well. But yeah, we're all Where done. We Gonna like head home now. The sun has come out a little bit. Oh. 
It's really Glorious. good. Glorious. We'll really back. good. Um, and yeah, we're gonna head back. I don't think I wanna take content today. I'm not really feeling it. And it's also really cold. So yeah, maybe another day I'll just do some bits, but I might do some bits when I get in as well. I just got home. I went to go pick Milo up from Marcus's sisters. And now I'm about to have one of my prepped meals. So today I'm having some smoked pulled beef, garlic herb, crushed new potatoes with char grilled broccoli, sesame and crispy garlic. It is so good. Like I have literally been living on this because it's really good for lunchtime. Lunchtime I always skip meals. So having this has been perfect. I don't think I've spoken about it on here, but if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know I speak about it all the time. I love the fact that it's chef crafted. So it's actual chefs that make this food and it just tastes so yummy. It's fresh and it lasts a really good amount of time. You just warm it up and you're good to go. And they're really tasty, like really, really, really tasty. I know some of you asked as well about it, saying that, you know, it'll be really good for like your lifestyle much because sometimes you don't have time to cook. Um, but you'll be seeing so many of these coming up. I'll link it in the description as well. So you guys can check it out for yourselves but this is how it looks i'm gonna eat my food and then i'm gonna edit and i need to go through the contract for the new shop and that's me done for the day i'm so tired it's five o'clock already milo's had food marcus is away for work for the next two days so it's just literally me and milo for the first time and i can't lie i'm somewhat nervous um so yeah and i wanted to do a bit of mirror content as well so I'll probably do that. My makeup has been on since 7 a.m. and it's 5.12. I feel like it's really lasted without any touch-ups, by the way, as well. Mm. <laughs> oh, I'm crying. Touch it. <laughs> oh, hell no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm.